So I started work on my first um, Unity game that's not part of the tutorial I was, or the, um, the class I was taking before. And so uh, it's called Eric's uh, Comet Competition. And it's kind of a, a Comet Destroyer's clone um, that I wanted to develop. Uh, so, you know, just kind of working on what I learned before, trying to figure out how to move this guy around. And so the first thing I wanted to do was kind of take a look at angles. And what's interesting is <laughs> the way I've ended up doing things, I can rotate the guy um, backwards of the button pushing. But you see, it's kind of like winding up like a like a like a coil and then it kind of like then if I let go so I'm not pushing the button anymore it just tries to slowly write itself to be right side up so for example if I put him right there he tries to go back put him here here he tries to go back so I'm not quite sure what I'm doing uh, at the moment but I think it's funny that he wants to be facing up he doesn't want to be turned sideways as if he was on a coil spring, he tries to right himself again and and uh, won't won't stay sideways. It's kind of interesting. In fact, if you look here, you'll see that the number gets smaller and smaller and smaller as it tries to get closer and closer to zero. So he starts going more and more slowly back to where he wants to be. So I think that's pretty funny. I'm going to play around with things a little more, see if I can get it to rotate and stay where I rotate it, but I like that. So again, if I kind of speed him up a little, go over there, and then you'll see the numbers start going slowly back, 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 back towards zero. So <laughs> don't know why that's happening, but I think that's pretty funny.